Today was a very interesting day for the Little Hoto volcano. We saw a collapse of the wall of the volcano, the southwest uh, one. You can see here, the big chunk of the wall comes down and falls into the cauldron or the crater of the volcano. It's colder than the lava, it's solid. So it will solidify or make it pasty, the lava which flows around it. That creates gradually a barrier in front of the exit of the lava, creating a pond or pool of lava behind it. It's like a dam. And that what happens is that if we have an overspill, of course, it's now big enough that it can take everything. But then this dam gradually drains. When it drains and you see the last blobs of the lava, including the wall which collapsed, coming out like that, several pieces which are now like a little softer than what they were when they were solid they come out and what is left is a deep canyon the canyon the height of the volcano is around 35 meters now so the canyon must be around yeah 8 to 10 meters at least it can be even deeper depending on the where where is the base top of the lava or the bottom of the lava pool and as you can see here it drained now and the canyon is revealed. We have seen similar canyons, always wondered how they are formed. We saw it here. You see in the Samero, you saw it there, Summit Canyon, and you saw it in the Merapi. There's many, many examples of this around the world. And now, for the first time, we have seen how these canyons are actually created. Damned Lava Deep Canyon.